What's going on guys? Edgar from the Ethical World Network here and I have a little bit of a special treat for you guys. Now in anticipation for Smash Brothers, we all are trying to play as much of the game as we can, but I got a little tired of Brawl. Um, Brawl, I mean, um, Project M is sort of fun, but you know, I kind of wanted to try out some new things. So anyways, there's this new Smash Brothers game, or rather it's not new, but it's been recently updated and it's really clean. Um, a Smash Brothers game on PC, which is called Super Smash Flash. A lot of you may have heard about this game. In fact, I guarantee a lot of you have heard of this game or play it on a regular basis. I only just discovered the game myself. And so what I was going to do is play through some Super Smash Flash with you guys today. I've been playing this for fun for um, a couple of days now and now I'm really into it. It's it's a fucking trip, man. I love this game. It's it's extremely fun, and I'll have a link in the description for you guys if you want to play it. But it's basically Super Smash Brothers. Um, as you're going to see, you just um, how do you wait? Oh, here we go. Wait, here we go. Yeah, and you can um, and so now like in terms of characters, the game has like as you can see a somewhat of a different roster now because this isn't under the domain of Nintendo. You can pretty much put any character that you want to in this game, and they certainly did just that. As you can see here, you have um, Lloyd Irving from um, Tales of Symphonia. You have Sora, Ichigo, Naruto, and Goku, and you, they also have the Black Mage. So you know there's definitely some more variety when it comes to these guys in this game, and it's fun to be honest, man. It's all pixel and it kind of looks a little bit lame but trust me it plays and feels exactly like Smash Brothers and that's why we are going to get into this shit today um, what I'm going to do is just put myself up against a random level 9 computer and we are going to go and play a level here now there's no music because I usually put my own music in the background so I'm actually going to do that now because um, I have a song that I want to use for this um, where is it where is it there we go I'm getting fucked up I'm getting fucked up there we go. Let's go. Okay. So, um, as you can see, this game... Oh my god! I'm on the level 9 computer right now, so I'm gonna get my ass busted at first. Let me see if I can redeem myself. Okay, I'm getting fucked up. <laughs> oh shit. Let me get into the game. Let me get into the game. I got my track playing, too. Let's go. Come on. So, if you guys... You may not be able to tell this because you're watching, but the game feels exactly like Super Smash Bros. Like, right now, even though I don't have the GameCube controller, the feeling of this game is, oh my god, it's so organic. Like, I'm really feeling like I'm playing Smash at the moment. And all the characters who currently exist in the game, their um, renditions in this game are totally true to what they play like in, um, in, and well, it's a combination of Brawl minus, I mean, excuse me, not Brawl minus, it's a combination of Project M and Brawl for some of the movesets, but they feel exactly like their counterparts do in the actual game, so. Yeah, you, you're in for experience if you play this. Lloyd Irving is actually my main now. I'm pretty damn good with him. Even though you can't tell right now. <laughs> I'm getting my ass beat. That's only because I had to put my song on. Alright, now we're in the game. Let's get our heads in there. Let's go. As you can see, there's Smash Balls too, so... Anyways, this Samus is fucking me up. Let me get in. Let me, let me concentrate. Let me go. Let me concentrate. Let's go. Come here. As you can see, I'm playing with this keyboard now. Okay, here we go. There we go! Mmm! Lloyd Irving in the building. Let's move, baby. You know, I can't wait for Super Smash Bros. 3DS, of course, but this is a really great pastime until that comes out. The game recently got updated, like, a few days ago to have an online multiplayer mode and to have a lot of things, actually. Like, the game got a huge update. A lot of it was a visual, but then again, no, it, not, it wasn't just visual, man. This game got a massive update, so it's really cool to see that they're still working on this because I know it's a little bit old. Okay, here we go. Let's go. Let's put in some work. Let's put in some more. There we go. Uh-huh. Nah, he's good. He's good. All right, so I got three stock for his two. Let's keep it moving. Let's keep it moving. Well, her two. I can't wait to play this online with people, but I know the process is a little bit um, bottlenecked right now because they have to register an account to play online. And right now, um, the accounts that want to be registered have to wait for a verification process, which is done manually by the game's creator. So because of that, it takes a little bit of a while for you to get your online pass going to play this. Let's go! Let's go, Lloyd! Woo! Mmm! Mmm! Double! Mmm! Oh, I almost finished him. There we go! Now, if you don't know, Lloyd Irving is from the Tales of Symphonia series. Well, Tales is a series, but he's from the game Tales of Symphonia. He's a really popular character and the reason why he's here 
Well, I mean, there doesn't really need to be a reason, but he actually debuted on the um, Tales of Symphonia for the Nintendo GameCube. You can find the game now for the PS3, and it's sequel for the PS3 as well, too. So, oh, shit. But um, that's where Lloyd comes from. A lot of people wanted him in Smash because he's pretty much the main character in the most popular JRPG on the Nintendo GameCube. So, taking all that into consideration, it's kind of... I mean... I guess he would fit in Smash, but I wouldn't see Sakurai putting him in, but he's still a really good character for it. Um, he plays amazing in this game, like he's not too broken, but he's really fun. He has all his moves from the game, you have the Rising Falcon, and his moveset is really interesting. Like look at this, he actually has a slash where he hits the ground and causes like an earthquake, and it hits everybody who's standing on the same level of ground with like this attack that makes them bounce. Okay, I'm getting fucked up here. Then again, we, we're fucking Samus up pretty good. Get out of here! Come on, fuck with me! Shit! <laughs> but you guys, I highly suggest, if you need something that plays a lot like Smash, that's, and you're tired of playing um, um, Project M, and you just want a different experience, this is an extremely fun game right now. I'm about to finish him with a special. Here we go! Origin Sword! That's how you do it, Lloyd! Yeah, extremely fun game. The frame rates are solid. The frame rates are extremely solid. Um, the games feel like... Alright, so I'm going to show you a different character now. Who I'm going to fight against. I'm going to show you Goku. So let's go. Um, here we go. Let's do this. Let's go! This song is actually from Dragon Ball Z, Planet Namek. So this is pretty cool actually. <laughs> but Goku is amazing in this game. Like he is a little bit on the broken side, but not to the point where he's obviously got something about everybody else. I mean he's got a lot of benefits in his favor, because you know he's one of the greatest fighters to ever exist in fiction, but Oh! Hit him really good with that Tempest. Let's get a juggle! Ooh! There we go. Perfect. Okay, never mind. Okay, so the last thing we want Goku to do is to get a Smash Ball. Because once he does that, I'm not even going to tell you what he does. You're about to see. I'm about to get fucked up. <laughs> Woo! Goku, when he gets a Smash Ball, turns into Super Saiyan Goku. Now, as you guys can see, every character that currently exists in the roster has, you know, a Smash Ball, um, a, a, a Final Smash. Yeah, it's, it's serious. This game goes very, very hard for these characters. And, you know, its roster isn't as big as um, Project M. But it's still really impressive that they managed to do all this, you know? Like, they put a lot of hard work into it. The only thing that's not the same is the, is the fact that it's pixelated, but everything else feels the same. There we go. Mmm, there we go. Let's take care of him. Mmm, there we go. Goodbye, Goku. <laughs> yes. And I haven't really played with too many characters, to be honest, because, you know, I kind of stay true to my people. <laughs> there we go. Come on, let's put some work. Let's put some work. Oh, watch out, Goku. Let's go, Goku. Let's go, Goku. Mm. <laughs> very good, very good. All right, here we go. Woo. Nice dodge. Ah. Mm. Oh, man, you see Goku's moves? Damn, he puts work in on me. Oh, I love using the Tempest. Oh, shit. Hmm. I really kind of wish Wood was in the actual game. <laughs> like, I'm getting really good with him. There we go. Hit him with that Tiger. Woo. And if you guys play Tales of Symphonia, you recognize everything that I'm doing with Wood right now. Mm. Da 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 da